This is my 2022 trimmer, adventure rig build. Almost a stock truck with the exception of leveling. So I did put a uh, nice puck in to level the truck and also the uh, SPC control arms because this truck has so much travel on the suspension looked like the uh, stock ball joints were going to break off also uh, put SPC bolts into the uh, lower control arm SPC makes cam bolts truck does not come standard with cam bolts so it will get out of a line and I did put uh, a transmission pan underneath there so there's an aluminum skid plate for the transmission did add some low profile lights to the front uh, all that is is just a plastic bumper piece so not a whole lot of depth to those lights they fit right in added ditch lights so I could see at night rack build started this with a to a pro it's a Moab and this is a max modular uh, bike rack mount I did have to do some uh, modifications on the rear here I had to make that uh, piece right here had to fabricate that but the, this piece is max modular got some grabby handles to get up there got some uh, lights on the rear all the lights are uh, easily wired into the uh, upfitter switches that come in this thing same upfitter switches like in uh, some of the nice 250s and the, uh, the Raptor Got a ton of uh, Railblazer mounts on these things. Uh, I think I've probably got six or eight mounts. Those are uh, G Hold 50, 50s. Yeah, I believe G Hold 50s uh, work great for paddles. Also for my oars when I'm running my raft rig, and then also old rod and reels I've got some uh, gun mounts that go in there they hold my skis but uh, got some mounted up in here and then here as well this is a for my paddle board and can't see right there The awning mount is pretty simple. Uh, two pins either side. Uh, tubing goes into tubing. And I believe that is, uh, uh, what's that cat here in Colorado? Gamma Viti, I believe, makes that. Revel off road for the uh, table holder. Holds a. Uh, Two foot by four foot uh, table. The rooftop is a Amazon purchase, hard top, and it is a Upland rooftop tent. I'll uh, pop that up and get a shot of that. Tailgate is my cooking service. Uh, this is a nice uh, food grade insert 
and that is made by Mountain Hatch out of Waxahachie, Texas. Five gallon water bottle held in uh, with a mount here. This is uh, Knoll Industries, a uh, company out of Arkansas. They make a lot of uh, stuff for boats primarily, but uh, worked great to mount that up. Built Right Industries Molly panel in there. Holding up the two handed axe and the uh, fire extinguisher in there with some. Uh, uh, let's see, I've got, uh, I think those are Colpin uh, mounts there. Same in the back for the shovel. I believe those are the same mounts. In there to hold the shovel in. Propane cylinder is, uh, I believe that's uh, Ontario Off Road. See that little logo there? And that is mounted in with a Range Industries bracket. I've got Range Industry uh, up front for the uh, Rotopax and over there as well. And then the cooler mount is also Range. And it mounts uh, using the stock bed bolts for the stock bed bolts, mounts that in. There's a shot of the rooftop tin all put up. Uh, again, that's a upland off of Amazon. Definitely doing the job. Carry a six ton in that Milwaukee pack out. Uh, tow rope, some soft shackles, basic uh, recovery stuff. And also got some uh, air over there. In case I have a complete flat and uh, airing down, airing back up. So the stove. Uh, I was in this Pelican case here, run a gas one, uh, 15,000 BTU, makes for a good uh, cooking surface right here, prep surface, laid a lot of fish on that uh, cutting board as well as cooking on it, but uh, I think that's about everything on this build. Yeah, the awning is a straight uh, Iron Man awning. Just comes straight out, two legs, and uh, haven't uh, put a bat wing on there yet. The 270s just haven't uh, went there yet. But that is the 2022 Trimmer Adventure Rig. I don't really call it an Overland rig. Uh, I got it primarily for uh, just a. You know, going out and do the things I do. I don't uh, put the truck in class three, class four trails. Usually just uh, forest service off road. So it's got plenty of clearance. Got the uh, torsion, limited slip uh, front diff. She comes standard with lockers on the trimmer. So really nice truck. Uh, pushing the uh, 3.5 Eco Boost Turbo. It is uh, definitely getting us where we need to go. And uh, Drags that micro mini just fine over there. About uh, just about 11,000 pound towing capacity on this truck. So really nice, uh, really nice truck. Rides real well, and uh, probably the, the definitely the uh, nicest riding truck uh, I've ever owned. There she is, 2022 Trimmer Adventure Build. 
any of the uh, stuff I got on here, if you got uh, questions, I can probably answer it. Just uh, kind of put it together one piece at a time. Kind of had the idea of how the whole thing should look, and uh, I've probably been four to six months at it, uh, completely built out with everything I wanted on it. But, uh, that is the truck.